it's definitely time for this thing to come out like y'all do y'all see this <laughs> like it is through okay my if you guys can see that so this is the hair after all day almost 9 30 at night Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. I love love Lex 71. I am Lex and in this video I'm back after almost a full month of wearing the Sugar Virgin hair which can be purchased off of AliExpress. So if you guys need to check back on the specs of this hair and all this other stuff, I have two videos up. I have a full unboxing, initial thoughts, taking out the package, wetting it, the whole nine. And I also have an installation video. It's not really a tutorial. I just put it up there just to put it up there but you can see the hair how it looks in its natural form as well as when I define it with my denim brush so let's go ahead and get started with this one month review um yeah <laughs> so I really do like the hair first and foremost because I know I can be very detailed I know I talk a lot so for the people that just want to know Lexus like, how does it work out I thoroughly enjoy this hair and that's no BS okay I, like I said I have purchased from this um, company before from their parent company which is Peerless Virgin here off of Valley Express as well they are affiliated they're not going to tell you that but they are the marketing is the same the prices are the same the hair is the same everything is the same okay so um I purchased their Peruvian Body Wave which is very popular and I thoroughly enjoyed that hair the only thing I personally did not enjoy about the hair is that it is silky and I'm going to get into that yeah. later so um yeah let's go ahead and get into this so I have in well when I filmed my installation video I did a deep side part um sew in so it's fully on my hair it's been on here it hasn't went anywhere for the past month and um I put it in that Saturday and then the following Saturday I went ahead and took it out and then I reinstalled it like two hours later and the reason why I did that was because this hair and trying to blend with type 4 natural hair Texlax hair perm hair that hasn't had a relaxer in a while it's not the move like not at all okay so in on camera I don't know if you guys can tell but this hair is very silky and I had this headband on for a reason I became the chick with the Hicks Edge control pushback with a headband like to hide that perimeter because like it's a mess like <laughs> okay like it's clearly time for this hair to come out track showing and everything but um they do offer closures with the hair, I believe all lengths from 12 to 20 inches maybe. And the only thing I personally did not like about the closure was that they did not process the hair all the way from the root to tip with the same texture. It was more of a body wave and then it became more of a deep wave curly. And also the lace on the um, on the lace closure was of a light skin lace. It was a light, um, the light mesh and not the medium brown mesh. So it was not the move for me. But I will say that there are a lot of other ladies that are my skin tone and deeper that went ahead and used the closure and it did look fine. But um, I just didn't use it and I honestly wish I did. Okay, because <laughs> I probably would have just went ahead and took the L than having to deal with this. So now it is installed as a Ivy Powell flip over method. And um... Let me scoot back so you guys can see the hair. Um, this is not as big as it gets. I literally just got out the shower maybe, I don't know, an hour and a half ago. Not not even that long. And I went ahead and I um like did the, the diffuser. I don't know what's going on with me tonight, guys. But I went ahead and I used the diffuser to kind of go ahead and dry the hair a little bit. But it does get huge. I'm going to insert um, footage of how it looks later on. But it is still very damp. But like I said, I reinstalled the hair. I started off with 3.85 bundles. I went ahead and installed all five. So this is five bundles of the hair. 22 inches, lightly layered at the bottom. Not even a good layer. Like you could tell like right here it was cut. But back here it wasn't touched at all. So this is the true like 22 inches right there. And um, I'm going to show you guys the back. I do have a, a track that is that just slipped out. <laughs> like... <laughs> so disregard that but this is how the hair looks if you guys can see that the curls are absolutely beautiful 
all right so let's get into the questions the main questions of a hair review how is the shedding the tangling and everything with that okay so the shedding of the hair is very good if you check my last review on a lavi um what is it, the lavi hair the lace um, lace wig that i had like the shedding was horrendous on that hair like I kept the bag of it for every single week so you guys can see how I look and I always do that. So I did the same with this hair as well. But this time I just didn't put it in bags. I kept it to the side. So the first, remember I wore it for the first week. Um, so for about four days, three, four days after I made that video, <laughs> I came, I went ahead and I detangled the hair as usual. And this is how much shedding I got. This was it. After detangling almost four bundles of hair after wearing it for almost four days curly hair okay so then the next week um shedding increased a little bit i mean i did cut the webs i chopped them up pretty bad i think so shedding did increase and this is how much i got but i feel like this is the standard for this hair if you do a weekly or bi-weekly detangle so just keep that in mind but this really is not bad for curly hair the units that i sell on my site curly hair is going it's going to do this if not more okay so this isn't jack all right and then from as you guys can see this hair is actually still wet this is the um hair that i just lost right now as i detangled this hair so you mean to tell me and almost like i don't i think i missed a week but three weeks this is about three weeks of detangling this is all i got okay and then keep in mind that when i wore this hair i did not tie this up every night Probably two times out of the week, I did go ahead and I did the pineapple, um, ball the hair towards the top of my head, and then I used this, like, um, as they call it, a Marley rag, just to uh, keep the puff in. But other than that, no, I took this clip right here. <laughs> I took one side, took the other side like this, and I went to bed, okay? So all this was just out exposed. Um, I have not been sleeping well lately. Um, I think I need a new mattress. So, <laughs> like, this hair has been tousled all over the place. And I just did not care. And honestly, after all that, this is all the detangling and shedding that I got. That is really excellent for this hair, okay? So, you're good to go. Oh, as far as tangling, you do get tangles at the nape. Um, you're not going to see any now because clearly I detangled it. But you do get tangles right here at the nape. It has not been a bird's nest. My hair does not creep up. If I move, it moves and all that good stuff there. It never fails me. It doesn't matter if it's day one curls or day six curls. They all just look very nice. Um, as most curly hair does, it does look more natural as the days go by. And it does um, expand a lot, okay? So, yeah. So, you're probably looking at this like, man, five bundles, man. Bye. But, no, like, it really gets bigger. And the hair is probably only... 75% dry like it's really damp up in here okay all right so let's see what else also with this hair if you are more of a wet look a lot of people like the wet look the Dominican look the Spanish Puerto Rican mommy look this hair is excellent for that because it has a very nice luster and you know if you put some defining creams on here it'll look like you just got out of the ocean okay it's very pretty you guys know I like more of a coarser texture more of a drier texture so um i can get that as well but i will have to wait to probably t day two or day three curls for it to have more of a low luster look so that's that shedding tangling um yeah the cons that i have are personal cons i have absolutely no problems with this hair the cons that i have is that like i said it is more of a um silkier like a smoother texture just on day one day two but then it does get very natural looking um in comparison with this in my queen hair products hair um because both of them are deep wave curly this hair right here does not have as much poof as queen hair products because queen hair products hair has a individual ringlet individual spiral as when they process the hair this hair is more of a just a full defined uniform wave so therefore even when you define the hair excuse me you find yourself having to kind of pull the, the curls apart because they kind of want to just become one interlock <laughs> you know so other than that when I say interlock I don't mean tangle but they just kind of want to you know wrap around each other like that but other than that I mean this hair is excellent it's great I really wish I would have just went ahead and put it on a unit I still do have a closure I may um, do that who knows but that's it it's definitely time for this thing to come out like y'all see this <laughs> 
<laughs> like it is through okay my installation of this hair was absolutely hard just keeping it in for a month but like i said this hair is more on the high end as far as price goes for aliexpress i feel like it is thoroughly worth it i feel like a lot of these resellers you know a lot of these small businesses are probably reusing this hair i would not be surprised and if you are looking for maybe a deep wave curly i would definitely go ahead and get some samples of this hair to be honest with you um another thing i do want to say about this hair is i wish i would have did a test strip on bleaching it but i have seen other reviews where the hair does bleach um pretty well but the hair is very black i forgot to mention that this hair as well as my peruvian um body wave hair was like damn near jet black it's smooth but it is black okay so um this camera may be having it more of a 1B and I guess, but y'all know when y'all get the hair from AliExpress or any virgin hair, no matter what company it is, virgin hair from, um, direct from the, you know, the importer or what do you call it? If you get virgin hair directly from the source, it still has kind of like those natural rays natural um ombre to it this hair is just always black okay it doesn't matter what's going on i don't know if they chemically dye it that way i did have a little runoff in my um sink at first i did not have that from my peruvian body wave but i did from this this time and i did have more of a chemical smell um but it went away completely after i just used my favorite cheap old vo5 conditioner in the hair and it was good to go so anyway that's my update sorry to keep you guys for 11 minutes but i want you guys to get the full details because we talking about almost three four hundred dollars for this hair for aliexpress like it ain't no hope so i want you guys to know what you're getting into all right so thank you guys for watching please stay tuned for further updates videos and everything i need to reach out to another company that hit me up and see what's popping so i can get you guys some more affordable hair options out there Check me out on Instagram at livelovelex71. Love you guys and bye.